Hey everybody, my name is Digidasm39, welcome back to another Tower of God. So last time, we had the sad and mysterious things of Rachel and Bam occur. I don't know why she didn't want to reveal herself. Also, Anak. Also, that's the thing. So, so he has to give her the Black March, right? He has to give Anak the... Sorry, uh, I'm losing my mind here. Let me start over. So, yeah, we have the Rachel and Bam situation go down. And also, I'm looking at the first panel, and it's Jumpsuit Boy with a sword being held against him, which I have to assume is a knack. But I have, what I have to wonder, so he has to give her the Black March now, right? Because he didn't win the crown game? I, I don't know. I'm not sure. I'm not sure about the spe specifics, but maybe she'll let him keep it because of his heroic, because of his actions. But who knows? All I know is that I want to get into this chapter and see what the fuck is going on. So 27 and 28. Here we go. Why did I say 28? I'm probably going to just keep doing these in four now for again at least <laughs> what what's this you suddenly bust in and I've got a favor to ask I wanted you to break into Bam's room and steal the black March huh so what you're saying is that the boys weapon won't listen to you oh so she did already take it but it doesn't so it does but it doesn't like her interesting yes she said she said she doesn't want to speak to a girl. Well. That's why you came here? You want me to talk to this weapon? Yes, tell her to listen to me. Even if you ask, ask me, I wouldn't know what to do. I've never tried talking to a needle. How should I call this? Uh, so Black March, was it? Can I talk to you for a second? Ah! <laughs> so the Shinsu manipulation was the sword itself. Okay. And I like how it just summoned a lightning bolt to strike him down where he stood. <laughs> Why is she angry? She's angry because she got taken away. Yeah, she got taken away from her boy. The boy that she was riding with. Cause, she, Cause I don't know, maybe she wants me, him to be the one to return her, or maybe it's because she saw something else in the boy. That's weird, why did she get mad? Are you a girl? N never. You say my baby Johnson doesn't exist? <laughs> Damn, let me try again. I'm a guy though! I give up, I might die. In the first place, why are you trying to possess a weapon that hates you so much? You already have Green April. Is there a reason you should collect them? There is. Why is that? Do you think I'll tell you? Whatever. Well, anyway, I think she's she wants a better guy than me. Maybe you should just ask a better man, Anak. I came to you because I thought you... I thought you... I thought you were good enough. Wow, really? You see people with your heart. Aw. I was wrong. Hey! Hey! Sweatsuit! Let's drink. Aw. I think you're good enough to have a girl visiting at... N at night. No, that... No, that's not a girl. She's an old lady who doesn't count an act. What? Stop calling me an old lady. You called me sweatsuit too. Ah, my Johns. <laughs> a 
Heyo! And you're gonna be added to the thumbnail dictionary, essentially. Hi! That turns away. Ignored me? Hmm. You know, even... You do... Do you even know who the owner of, of Black March is? I don't care. Yuri Jihad. She's the recent... She's the only one to receive one of the 13 months out of all selected Jihad princesses in the past five centuries. So any relationship that Anak it tries to have will immediately be considered her being a MILF. <laughs> She's the only one to receive- oh sorry. She's a prodigy fisherman who became a high ranker within less than a century after becoming a ranker. She's feared by young rankers because of her vicious temper. Hmm. Did you know that? Don't get killed acting, acting cocky. I know who you are, you fake. So she isn't a Jihad. I mean, that would be kind of weird considering... Well, then again, I don't know what J Jihad's into. Maybe centuries ago he was just into lizards at one point. <laughs> we don't know, man. I warned you, don't blame me later. Hey, you spooky eyes, one question. Who, who's spooky eyes? You jerk! Anyway, I've got a question. That girl Rachel on your team, who is she? Bam seemed to know her. I don't know. You don't? I don't know. The first time I saw her during the test, and she and we just happened to team up. Though the huge one was already with me. Anyway, when I first met her, I felt that I shouldn't fight her. That's why I made a team with her. You felt that you shouldn't fight? Yeah, it's hard to explain. She... Is she that strong? Hmm. I feel like she'd kind of be like the... Hmm. I don't know. Oh well. That kind of character, but... That voice will get very annoying for my throat very quickly. No, not really. The huge one is strong, but Rachel... Well, I shouldn't... I should say she... Uh, I should say she's different. That's all, folks. She likes... She likes when someone who lived in a different world. Or she feels like that. Hmm. Hmm. I wonder why. Hmm. 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 <laughs> Bam. Are you dead? Did you know Bam well? Yeah. I knew him since before I came into the tower. It's amazing how you two ended up taking the same test. Bam was a lonely boy. He was always alone and lonely. Before he came up the tower, the only friend Bam had was me. When he heard I was going up the tower, Bam cried and told me not to go. But why was his haircut is the thing. But I left him and came into the tower, and I thought I would never meet him again, but he appeared in front of me. I couldn't take Bam's crown, so I decided to help him. While I wasn't a big help, my teammate were. By the way, can I have that? Oh, help yourself. Aw, bananas. But I, ju but I just made things worse. You got hurt because of me. Bam can't go up the tower because of my existence. Because his wish is not to go up the tower, but to be with me. If I stay with him, he won't go any further, and he wouldn't let me go. So, Mr. Coon, don't tell Bam about me. Yeah, I, f I figured he was go she was gonna tell him to not tell him about this conversation and tell him that it wasn't Rachel. But who knows? Maybe there he'll have another motive to ha to go up the tower. Because as someone told me, uh, Bam becomes the messiah of the tower? He somehow ends up becoming this figure that will somehow lead mo t 
tons and tons of people up the tower to get their desires or something. At least that's what I've heard. Mainly the the Messiah part, but I don't fucking know. So maybe he'll have a drive to get everybody up the tower so that they can finally leave. What do you want? What do you mean, don't tell? Do you want me to tell Bam that you that weren't that you weren't you? Yeah, he he wants to be with you so with he wants to be with you this much. Why can't you both stay here together? <laughs> Have you heard about the legend of the top of the tower? Oh my gosh, they're all getting clothes. That's great. I mean, it's kind of cute that they all have it, or at least this team has a change of clothes. I mean, granted, they were all probably battle-torn. What are you doing, Crocodile? N no, I just, it's not like I'm worried about that turtle. Or anything, Baka. <laughs> I'm sorry, he's acting like such a Sutendere. I just wanted to check if my prey is okay. Just, just a food check, okay? Come in if you're worried. Don't stay there like a guy with a crush. You got it wrong, I'm cold hearted! Have you heard about the legend of the top of the tower? The top of the tower? Do you mean the legend that says you can see the real sky and stars when you get to the top of the towers? Yes, since the time I first heard about it, when I was young, I always dreamed of myself watching the stars at the top of the tower. Every time I opened my or I closed my eyes, I saw the infinite sky with the numerous stars. Ah, hey, this is the picture from the petition. Go find that, and you all pay for it. Damn it, you all help that kickstart. We need that shit. We need that anime. Cause this definitely deserves to be an anime. Granted, I don't think I don't know how I feel about Netflix being the ones. Cause the petition is to have Netflix do the an make the anime. I think, but I'm not quite sure. I don't know. They just have a weird reputation when it comes to anime. You know. <laughs> It was beautiful enough just by imagining it, so I thought my eyes would go blind if I ever, if I saw it for real. Just the thought of it made my heart pound. The sole goal in my life is to reach the top of the tower someday. I really want to be with Bam. That's why I gave up the crown and stayed here. But even now, I can see the stars when I close my eyes. Such beautiful light fills my heart. And I can't sleep at night. Hey, turtle! Turtle! Hey, is he dead? Say no! <laughs> Aw. Didn't you say you're not worried? I'm sure you've been a nice... I'm sure you've been the nice guy in town. Open your eyes, turtle! If not, I'll eat you, turtle! Hey, you! Sorry, Bam. I promised her that I wouldn't tell the truth to Bam. The next day, the test began, and Bam woke up two days after the test started. Shit. You ate all? You ate all these yellow things? I'll kill you! Did this jerk come here to eat? <laughs> I don't know what this guy's deal is. <laughs> She sometimes told me stories about the sky and stars. Bam. Do you know what's at the top of the tower? I don't care. You really don't have any hopes and dreams? Well, okay, that's probably why he didn't... He becomes the messiah, is because he doesn't have... Is because he doesn't exactly have a reason to go up the tower. He doesn't have any desire or dream that he can't achieve 
without just doing it himself, without the tower's help, essentially. I don't know. It's probably just because he doesn't want... He doesn't need, want anything to do with the tower to, to begin with. On top of the tower is some, something called the sky. Sky? What's that? Um, lie down, Bam. Aww. <laughs> That's like the position they GLaDOS and Portal tells you to take in order to be retrieved for the for the cake party. It's like lay down with your arms spread out and put the portal gun on the ground. An associate will come to collect you. <laughs> Close your eyes. Close my eyes and imagine. Imagine. I has no imagination. <laughs> Those heavy rocks are all gone. Gone? Then we're, what's left there? Nothing. Nothing? Yes. Nothing blocks us. Wide sky. With s and stars come when the night comes. It's not the night that we're afraid of. It's the beautiful... The w it's the beautiful, the real night. I will go for sure one day. Rachel. Yeah? Stop saying silly things and let's just eat growl okay <laughs> well Rachel don't go don't go Rachel oh my heart my heart don't go Rachel don't go Rachel are you awake bam uh, <laughs> Mr. Kun, where am I? We're, st we're still on the test floor. Ow, my head! Take it easy, Bam. You're not fully healed. How long have I been like this? You've been unconscious for five days. Crocodile thought you were dead. He said he'll fry you yesterday. What? F five days? Then, Mr. Kuhn, what about the test? The test already began two days ago. Then, already? Then, did, did I, did I fail? Mr. Kuhn, bam, to tell you, to tell the truth, you're, you didn't fail yet, turtle. Huh? Why don't you tell him right away? Crocodile. I was about to tell him. What happened? How come I haven't failed yet, when the test started? Oh, that's how should I say? You were lucky. Yeah, Liroro pulled a couple strings, I bet. Long time no see, regulars. Did you have enough rest? Oh. He probably just prolonged the amount of time before the next test. I know it wasn't that long, but I hope you spent it well. You all look dr very driven. Oh, sorry, this is a flashback. <laughs> very well, I hope all you guys all work hard and on the test that begins today. Well, I, I will explain to you the best test that will begin now. The test you're taking this time is... Positioning test. Nani? Positioning test, which means... Yeah, I think a lot of you have noticed this already. As you well know, the fighting in the tower is usually done in a in a team. The position is the role that you'll pay or that you'll play during these battles. There are a lot of different positions, but basically there is the fisherman. What? <laughs> huh? Who disarms the enemy by using the real inventory, thus they are always at the heart of the battle. They can also carry out individual activities. So that's probably going to be Bam, because he has a needler, the needler of a fisher fisherman. Spear bearer, Rack. Light bearer, Kuhn. If Kuhn's not the light bearer, then it has to be Bam. Uh, who utilizes speed? who utilizes spears to target enemies from the back or finish off what the fisherman started. 
Light Bear, whose light, who lights up the Dark Tower, collects battle data, and feeds it to the Scout. Scout. Who scouts ahead at the very front lines using the Observer and assists the Fisherman when he charges. So he has to make an even bigger team? All in favor for a knack joining Bam's team say aye. <laughs> so that they so that she can give him back the damn Black March. <laughs> Wave controller. Who controls Shinsu to assist in battle or overpowers an opponent, they are known to dominate the battlefield. Of course, there are more positions beyond these five, such as a guide, but it doesn't have much to do with you. From now on, you will be assigned to one of these five positions, and you will be trained in that position for a month, and only the regulars with high results get the right to take the next test. Now look, the table shows your position according to the results of the previous tests. Okay. Uh, so Bam. Okay, so Bam is gonna be a oh a wave controller. Okay, that that's weird. So Fisherman is the best seated to be is Anak, but still she should give to, she should fucking give the Black Mart back to fucking Bam, cause he's the only one that she'll let use it. Uh, blah, 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 bunch of people that I don't know who the names belong to. The light Bearer. I've yet to see Kuhn. Oh, sorry, Kuhn is in Light Bearer, okay. Uh, but where's Rack? Oh, Rack's the Spear Bearer, duh. I'm sorry, I'm not being observant, I'm an idiot. So, Shibasu, Hats. Uh, Chinchi, Serena Linen, okay. So, I'm sorry, I'm gonna make a team here. Boop, 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 boop. Uh, I want the tracksuit guy, I assume this is the tracksuit guy. Boop. <laughs> I don't know why I did boop, I wasn't ever even clicking. Light Bear Bam is a wave controller? That's unexpected. So I'm with that boy. Ah, Sleepy Boy is a wave bearer too. Same position with the annoying one. <coughs> They're both thinking. Now I'm... How come I'm not a fisherman? <laughs> oh. What's that best seeded written beside the names? Best seed? People with best seed are the ones who did well in the previous tests. One person was chosen per test, and they get a bonus point in the final positioning. What? Oh, that's that's mean. That's cruel. Well, you didn't tell us all about that before. I don't understand why he got that. Yeah, why me? Did I offer a bribe or something? Well, you were you're a tactician, dude. It would make sense for you to be the scout. You were chosen, don't even ask. Haha, <laughs> the best seed tag is given off after a fair and thorough evaluation. I've got a lot to do, so stop asking petty questions, okay? Oh, okay. The the devious glare. Did I bribe him? <laughs> I don't remember bribing him. Maybe I'm just too fucking drunk. <laughs> hey, Mr. Rowe. There are many injured candidates here. So can they take the test? When they are more or less cured, they may start attending class, but the positioning class keeps attendance scores, so it so it is a disadvantage if you miss. I think that's unfair. The un or the injured will obviously miss some of the class, of course, but it is his fault for getting injured. 
It's obvious that people pay for their mistakes, isn't it? That's... Wow. That's really mean. It's because he doesn't like Bam anymore. It's because all of a sudden he's like, he used Shinsu in a way that isn't allowed. It's like, boy, he didn't even know. <laughs> he was passing out. He didn't even know what he did. Plus, how do you know it wasn't the black market itself? Well, that's it for today. The positioning teachers will explain the detail schedule for the test later. So please follow the guide and go where your position teachers are. Oh, and in the case of wave, wave controllers, the teacher has a problem. He will arrive a bit late. Ah, uh, ah, uh, I guess you do still like BAM. <laughs> he says he'll start class three days late. So you knew the amount of time it would take BAM to wake up? Okay. <laughs> well, now, well, now you all move to your classes, please. Wave controller? It's Bam's position. If it starts three days after three days, he can make it. So this is what happened. You start the test three days later than other positions. The class of five controllers starts... Of wa Why did I say five? The class of wave controllers starts tomorrow. You were very lucky. Other positions already had two classes. If you missed that, you might have lost a lot of points. Whew! What a relief. Yeah, wave controller classes might be hard, but all's good anyway. Um, so, uh, Mr. Kuhn. Oh, uh, why? <laughs> How's Rachel? Rachel? Do you mean the girl who say who you saved? Yes, she's... She's fine, the wounded wasn't... The wound wasn't deep at all. That's good. Or thank goodness, Rachel. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But, bam, that girl... I don't think she's the girl you were looking for. I asked her, and she said she's never seen you before. Sh she didn't know you. Huh? It, it can't be. I think you were confused, bam. That happens. Rachel. You broke the poor boy's heart! Dun 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 dun. Dramatic drop. Wait, what? Were you just shaving? Uh, I like how the soap thing says lol on it. Also, what is with this? Oh, is that just the clips that are keeping the bandages in? Oh, that girl was Rachel. It's a lie that she doesn't know me. Yeah, he knows Rachel too well. I mean, it's Rachel, for Pete's sakes. Rachel's trying to go up the tower without me. She's trying to reach the sky and stars. I don't get it, right? But I don't get it, R Rachel. Hey, oh! A nice, sleek jacket. Should I go now? Yep. How's that hit on your head doing? A beautiful sky and stars? Freedom? What's all that? I don't care about those things. Well! 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 Oh, that's a cute little bandana. I care more about you than all those thing, all those stupid things, Rachel. I mean, they're not really stupid, they're, they're sources of light that give life to many points throughout the universe. So there's no point in calling it stupid, considering the sun of whatever planet this tower is on is probably the thing that also is keeping you alive and not freezing, like, instantly, you know? So, I feel really bad for Bam. He's heartbroken. <laughs> Also, Wave Controller. I thought he was gonna be like really mad at Bam for what he did. Maybe he'll just tell him not to do that again, even though he won't even remember what he did. But still. Uh, Little Miss Urza Scarlet over there. <laughs> He's probably gonna be a little mad, you know? She's, she's probably just gonna be a little mad. Just a little, you know? 
just a little, a little smidgen. But who knows? All I know is that I have multiple uh, things to record today, and most of them consist of Tower of God. So, live long and prosper, always volunteer as tribute, and peace out. I hope you all have a really good day. I'll see you guys next time. Bye!